The world of pop music has been a multi-million dollar global industry for at least 30 years now, and Scotland was able to participate because here in Glasgow there was a venue capable of holding the supergroups for their live concerts. But after 12 years of Scotland's prestigious rock and roll theatre, the Glasgow Apollo bit the dust on June the 16th, 1985. <laughs> We're a good one there actually. The stage has really got to be the highest stage in the world. And of course we used to tell all the American actually that because that's because of the Glasgow Funders part, you know. And you've got to keep them back, you know. And we played there one night and there was two guys actually made it onto the stage. I don't know how they did it. And the bouncers were going to throw them off and we were saying, no, give them a prize. How did they get up there? You know? And they did.